I haven't really, I've repeated that achievement. It's the, <laughs> it's the same too, I'm pretty sure, that Jamie begun with, uh, because we saw their vehicle just nearby. But what I wanted you to do in addition to see them, just listen to how upset everything is around here. There's all the grey go away birds coming to shout at them. There are hornbills, drongos, starlings. And they just are so intolerant because they know that these owls are predators of theirs. And I think they probably all understand the, if not the exact language, certainly the essence of what's being said by all the others. And that is that there's a predator here, come and take a look, see where it is, and then you can decide whether you want to hang around here or go somewhere else. And to many people, this seems like a very strange reaction. Why, if they could see the predator, would they go anywhere near it? And the thing is, with most predators out here, ambush is the name of the game. If you're an owl, you hunt at night, you hunt completely silently and you ambush your prey. Same with lions, same with leopards. And the reason for that is that your prey is normally actually just as fast as you are. And although possibly not quite as strong, it is just as quick and if it has any kind of warning that you're there, well, then it will escape. And so being in close proximity to your predator when you can see it is often really not a risk at all. Not knowing where the predator is is far more a risk. And so to just sort of leave an area like this when you know that there are predators around without thoroughly investigating what's going on yeah, poses much more of a risk than being in close proximity to the predator.